I can't be the only one who gets GameCube memory card flashbacks, PS1, PS2 memory card flashbacks by looking at this image, right? Hey guys, it's Rob here and welcome to the Robo Choncho where we cover the latest gaming news. If you wanna be kept up on the latest gaming news, reviews, and more, click that subscribe button and of course have that notification bell on so you know when I upload. So recently a PlayStation cartridge patent was filed by Sony Interactive this year. Now credit going to spotting this patent goes to Dutch website Let's Go Digital and it features an image of a cartridge leading people to speculate that maybe the PS5 will use cartridges or maybe there's gonna be a PS Vita 2 or maybe something else. Now, if you remember the PS5 dev kit was revealed in the same way, a patent was found for the PS5 dev kit, which set the internet into a frenzy. And then we got that leaked photo of the real PS5 dev kit. But I want you to also consider the last time we got a cartridge patent. Now this was back in 2018 when it was filed and it popped up not too long ago, but it turned out to be something entirely. It wasn't even gaming, it was something else entirely, a different product. So this could very well be the same thing, or it may not be. Now you're seeing the image on the screen right now of the patent of the Sony PlayStation cartridge. The huge difference between the last cartridge patent by Sony and this one is that it's not only called the Sony PlayStation cartridge, Archer, it's pointing to the gaming side of Sony, but it's also designed by Yujin Morisawa, who makes and designs products for PlayStation. But the caveat here is, is that it's not just PS4 stuff he makes. He also makes other products that aren't related to gaming. Now, the reason why this is more than likely not for the PS4 or the PS5 is that the PS5 has already been confirmed to use Blu-ray discs, but that doesn't mean a PS Vita 2 is ruled out. The Nintendo Switch is a massive success, not only only that, but the Switch Lite is also a huge success and will most likely sell even more and be more profitable for Nintendo coming in the next holiday. Sony could be seeing the wild success and want a piece of that market. Hell, the PS Vita wasn't exactly a bad system, it was more just marketed horrible by Sony, so a PS Vita 2 would be very interesting, something I'd personally like to see, honestly. And real quick guys, if you want more gaming news on the PS5, Nintendo Switch, and other gaming topics, make sure you click that subscribe button. Now say the PS Vita 2 is in Sony's mind, then the question kind of becomes when could we hear about the PlayStation Vita 2? Well, recently PlayStation CEO has stated that they want to focus more on the PS5. They want PS4 owners to upgrade to the PS5 as fast as possible. They're going to be putting a huge focus on the PS5 in 2020, which means announcing the existence of a PS Vita would not be the smartest thing to do if you want all your attention and sales to be on the PS5 in favor of the PS Vita. Vita 2 if it was a real thing. So I don't think we're going to hear anything from Sony themselves about PS Vita 2 if it is real or maybe we may even get more uh, leaks like this one. And again, this is just kind of speculating if this is a PS Vita 2, if that is a real thing, which I honestly wouldn't mind. I would actually like to see PS Vita get another chance. So then what the heck is this cartridge patent? Well, it could be an accessory for the PS5. Maybe Sony's bringing back the memory cards in some way, shape or form. We know that the PS5 will be doing 4K, so that's gonna take a huge storage amount. So having the option to extend your storage with a memory card could benefit the PS5's game that are very large. And not to mention, as time goes on and devs learn more about the PS5 graphics and hardware capability, file sizes will end up being larger or smaller depending on what kind of game. If it's like a JRPG, obviously those are gonna be smaller than if you were to do a maybe Witcher 4, which now that I think about it, it would be really cool if they announced a Witcher 4 for the next gen. That would be, oh my God, that would be amazing. But those are just my thoughts on this whole situation. What do you guys think on this Sony PlayStation cartridge patent? What do you think it's for? Tell me in the comment section below and don't forget to subscribe, like, and share this video. And I'll see you guys in the next video. And also real quick, this is different than what I usually do. I usually don't have myself on screen. I usually use a character. Those people who have subscribed to me obviously know that I use a character, but honestly my pack, it was killing me today. So I didn't wanna sit in this chair, This crappy chair that I found at a flea market and uh, hurt my back even more than it already does. So I'm doing this just for today. If you guys like this format, make sure you tell me in the comment section below and I will switch over to this if you like this more than the character. Um, thanks for watching my video after explaining how my back hurts and I'm an old man apparently. Uh, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a good one.